This is a Game Caviar production. Okay, so not having it in the Game Caviar Studios, I'm back with some more Black Ops gameplay domination on Nuketown. I'm really looking forward to, that, forward to that Nuketown 2025 or whatever the hell it's called in Black Ops 2, which is coming out in November. And um, after playing Black Ops tonight, I just, I'm really worried about Black Ops 2. I just, I can't put it into words, man. Like this match right here uh, really reminded me of some of the issues that just plagued black ops and call of duty in general one of the main things was the spawn system in call of duty like i never really had an issue with spawn system in black ops black ops was more of a uh hit detection was off and yeah uh, laggy um matches and whatnot but here man we basically got spawn trapped we got we got more than spawn trapped. we got spawn raped this whole match and we were basically stuck on the the um this side of the map where you see me playing for most of the uh the match and we were just you know relegated to this area for the most part and it really made it hard for us to really push forward and get more flags because those guys were on our ass the whole match and it just between this game and modern warfare 3 and we all know modern warfare 3 has really shitty spawns it has really uh really crappy spawn system and um one of the things that I just, it's like a make or break thing for Call of Duty is, look man, Treyarch, please, whatever you do, if you're not going to put in dedicated servers or any other of the things that people want, please at least fix the spawn system. Two of the biggest problems that I have with Call of Duty right now are the spawn systems and the use of sniper rifles in normal game modes. I think that the use of sniper rifles kills the flow of, um the game and it really disrupts and infuriates a lot of players uh but the spawn system has to be proficient like i i mean it's like um called cod 4 had a, a decent spawn system modern warfare 2 had a had a good spawn system um hell even fucking world ed war had a really good spawn system but what happened beyond that when black ops came out and when Modern Warfare 3 came out, look at this guy laying down in my damn way. Um, it, it just, it really went downhill from there. And I don't want to kill a guy. And then uh, three seconds later, he's behind me so he can kill me. I have no idea why Infinity War chose to do that in Modern Warfare 3. Or more importantly, why they chose not to fix it. Did they think that it was going to be some sort of good idea? Or, you know, to, was that sp supposed to foster... Uh, competitive um, a competitive mentality I don't understand why they did that and um, I, I just wish that Treyarch would really understand the failures of Modern Warfare 3 and not make the same mistakes in Black Ops 2 the game is like a month away literally I don't want to see um, the, the the issues with spawn traps and yeah you, know, you know laggy servers and take care of this man like you make millions and millions of dollars on this game every year from people who pay you sixty dollars at least for this game do something to make it seem like our money is not going down the drain i bought modern warfare 3 i felt like i absolutely wasted my money on that game do i still play it sure uh sometimes you have really good games and really good matches and I, I think I got it to the point to where I figured it out to where I can have decent uh, a decent match on a consistent basis but the things that I have to surrender in order to do that is against my playing style and it's just not the way I like to play uh, first person shooter games but with all that being said I want Treyarch to look at this um, if they would look at this video, it'd be awesome. But I want them to look at Modern Warfare 3 and read the community and see exactly what people are saying uh, or, or what people are having problems with Modern Warfare 3 and try not to duplicate that in, Call, in Black Ops 2. And look at all of the problems people have had in the first Black Ops and try not to duplicate those issues these guys are smart enough to make a whole video game on what three different systems but i fail to believe that they have no idea how to fix these issues in the game i think that they got their money they got lazy and they're getting called out on it 
So their back is against the wall, so they don't have any other choice but to do that, but to uh, fix the issues. Will they do it? We'll see in a month. I'm not having it in the Game Caviar Studios, and I'm out. This has been a Game Caviar production. Like this video and subscribe for more.